Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Ishmael from Conjured Realm. Okay, so in today's video, I wanted to talk to you guys all about focus and shifting your focus and the importance of focus while manifesting. So focus is something that's super, super, super important for you to understand because you start to realize that the things you are paying attention to is what keeps things a certain way in your reality. And if you want them to shift, you have to understand how this works if you want to get a different outcome. Now, when we are focused on something in our reality, we know that we bring it to us even more, even faster and more abundantly, right? So your focus is essentially your currency in this world. Your focus is super important because whatever you decide to look onto or search or think about, you're spending your focus to attract that thing to you. Your focus is extremely valuable when you are manifesting and I need you to understand this because it is what has changed my manifestation night and day. My process has changed so much once I learned about shifting my focus. My process has become a lot easier. I started to manifest a lot faster and better. And in general, I've been living a more happier lifestyle because of shifting your focus or shifting my focus. It's all been just a really great experience. Your focus is very valuable in this world, in this realm that we live in that is the 3D. You have to learn not only to shift your focus, but to really ask yourself in certain situations, what should I be spending my focus on? And that has to do a lot also with emotional intelligence. And I'll speak briefly about this, but emotional intelligence is how you react to certain scenarios in your life. When I first started manifesting, I was very reactional. I was very explosive in my attitude. I had very bad anxiety. I was always anxious all the time. But it was why? Because I kept focusing on those things. I kept giving my attention and power to situations that made me upset, that made me angry. And in doing so, my mind had no choice but to continue giving me those scenarios and situations again and again and again. Once you understand emotional intelligence, you know that, okay, this happened, but I don't have to give it my attention full force. It's okay, it's not detrimental to my life. I can live without having to react so negatively to the situation. You know, sometimes people go out into the world and they get cut off in traffic and then they ruin their whole day because that's all they can think about. And being in that sour mood and attitude only brings you more negative sourness to your life. But had you only ignored what happened and went about your day and did not take things personal, you would have had a much better day. You didn't really have a negative bad day. You just had an awful two minutes that happened to you that, that you could not emotionally detach from that carried on throughout your whole day. So did you really have a bad day or did you just have five minutes of anger that was uncontrolled? And this ties into everything else we try to manifest like money. When you get the bills in the mail, when you get negative scenarios or situations in your life, what about it are you focusing on? Are you continuously focusing on the fact that after you get this bill in the mail, you will just constantly keep getting bills? Or do you choose to acknowledge that you got the bill and know, you know what? Money flows to me easily, abundantly, consistently. I just got this bill. I'm just going to go ahead and pay it because I'm abundant in my world. I am God here. My world takes care of me. I am abundant here. Money is constantly flowing. I have the money to pay for this. This is the outlook you should have with everything, not only money. Now let's switch over to an SP situation. Are you constantly always hyper aware that your SP is not texting you back? Are you constantly always almost expecting for your SP to do something negative only for you to notice it and lash out? You are spending your focus on the wrong things because like we know where attention goes, energy flows. So wherever we are spending our focus, that has no choice but to come back to us more and more and more. 
the way you would remedy an SP situation would simply be to notice something that you don't like, you know, like a contrast, and in your mind or affirm or script or visualize the scenario that is opposite to what you would want to happen or something you would want to experience. Essentially, you are shifting your focus to a scenario that is more beneficial to the outcome you are trying to receive. Remember, the 3D is very delayed. So the reaction that you gave to your SP in a negative way will have no choice but to continue to replicate in the future. But had you had a different shift in focus, the way you reacted to your SP, let's say in a calmer, more easygoing way, you just manifested a better outcome in the future when this 3D updates. So which one would you rather have or which one would you prefer to continue living? It is a practice that takes discipline. If you have been someone who's very reactionary your whole life, I'm not expecting you to get this in a matter of a few days, but try to test this out little by little. Maybe instead of having five outbursts a day, try to bring it down to four. Try to see every situation in a better light. This is how you not only fix your nervous system, by conditioning it not to be so reactionary and emotional at every negative situation that you encounter, but you also will be constantly manifesting better things into your life. Now, I don't know about you, but I am not someone that loves to stay in an angry type of mentality all throughout my day because I notice that when I do, more negative things start to happen and it just all around does not feel nice. So shift your focus to the outcomes that you want shift your focus to something that is not so reactionary remember we are creators not reactors all right guys if you like this video please give me a thumbs up and subscribe hit the bell notification icon so you're notified every time i post a new video also i'm still doing one-on-one -on -one coaching if you guys are interested email me at conjuredrealm at gmail.com all right guys happy manifesting